Your guardian angels have a very particular message for you if you clicked on this video today. They have led you to this point because they want you to be aware of a significant fact that has profound implications for your life. Thus, take a full breath, open your heart, and let the words that follow resound inside you. This message is about you, dear soul. It's about that inner force of intuition, which is both subtle and potent. You must have felt it right? That delicate prod, that calm voice directing you through the exciting bends in the road of life. Your instinct isn't simply an irregular event, it's a heavenly gift, an association with the divine domain. A beacon of truth about a woman in your life is currently being sent to you by your intuition. Perhaps she's a companion, a partner, an accomplice, or a relative. Your angels want you to know that you have the right feelings for her. Believe that internal knowing, for it is a consecrated compass, a compass made by the hands of the heavenly to control you in the correct heading. Imagine yourself in a peaceful setting surrounded by the ethereal light of angels as you listen to these words. Imagine the love and wisdom of your guardian angels surrounding you and pulsing through your very being. They are here to support your intuition and reassure you that you are not alone in deciphering your heart's intricate language. There is more to the story about the woman in question than meets the eye. Your instinct, that heavenly murmur, is uncovering layers concealed by the unaided eye. It resembles stripping back the petals of a sensitive bloom, uncovering the excellence and intricacy inside. Because it holds the key to gaining a deeper comprehension of your path, your angels want you to acknowledge and accept this intuitive insight. Every person in your life has a purposeful role to play in the tapestry. This lady is no special case. Your heavenly messengers believe that you should perceive the meaning of her presence in your excursion. She might be a mirror reflecting parts of yourself, illustrations to be learned, or an impetus for extraordinary development. If you look deeper than the surface, you'll find the meanings hidden within your connections threads. Presently, how about we dig into the center of your instinct? It is a sacred dialogue with the divine, not just a whim. Your holy messengers resemble divine couriers, and they've been working enthusiastically to speak with you through this instinctive channel. Your thoughts, feelings, and unspoken insights are all a part of a divine conversation that has been going on since your soul was created. Keep in mind that your angels will be there for you at every turn as you navigate this relationship's complexities. They see the excellence inside you, the light that occasionally gets darkened by the shadows of uncertainty. You are a heavenly being having a human encounter, and your instinct is the extension between the natural and the divine. Stop briefly and feel the affection radiating from your heavenly messengers. It is a love that recognizes your divinity and transcends time and space. Your angels want you to recognize how valuable you are, how strong you are, and how well you can navigate life's currents. Believing your instinct is definitely not an indication of shortcoming. It's a demonstration of your profound strength. Let's get to the bottom of any doubts you may still have. Questions resemble mists that quickly dark the sun, yet the sun is dependably there, sparkling brilliantly behind the cloak. Your angels want you to let go of those doubts and let them melt away in the divine understanding's warmth like morning mist. She is a soul on her own journey which coincides with your own for a reason. Your angels invite you to view the complex dynamics at play through the lens of compassion. Stretch out sympathy not exclusively to her, yet in addition to yourself. Embrace the insight that accompanies understanding that everybody is on their one-of-a-kind way, learning and developing as they go. As you consider the meaning of this message, recollect that your holy messengers haven't arrived to direct your activities, but rather to direct you with affection, 
The choices you make shape the fabric of your life because you have free will. Your angels tell you to approach this revelation with an open mind and a heart that understands how love and understanding can change things. Every note and pause in the grand symphony of life adds to the melody of your soul's journey. That symphony includes this woman with all of her nuance and complexity. The subtle harmonies beneath the surface notes are what your angels want you to focus on. You are an essential component of the unfolding divine dance, a sacred rhythm. Keep in mind that the path may not always be smooth as you move forward, guided by your intuition. Difficulties might emerge, and snapshots of vulnerability might test your purpose. Your angels want you to remain steadfast, like a majestic tree firmly planted in divine love's soil. You are versatile and you have the solidarity to face any hardship. In conclusion, dear soul, this message is evidence of your sacred connection to the divine. Through intuition, your angels have communicated with you, revealing profound insights about the woman in your life. Navigate the intricate dance of relationships with a heart full of love by putting your faith in this direction and respecting your intuitive knowing. May the wings of your heavenly messengers envelop you in a cover of heavenly light, directing you through the exciting bends in the road of your excursion. Embrace the insight inside, and may your way be enlightened by the brilliant shine of your instinct. You are a darling offspring of the universe and your holy messengers commend the magnificence of your spirit. Assuming that these words have impacted you, share your contemplations and encounters in the remarks beneath. Make this location a haven for divine insights and collective wisdom. Your journey is intertwined with many others, and we weave a web of love, comprehension, and spiritual development together. I declare that this will be a week of great health, financial success and congratulations. If you value God, please subscribe to our channel. God is telling you today, extraordinary favors are going to go into your life since you have accepted for such a long time. You never surrendered, you stayed reliable. Your devotion, enthusiasm, and persistence are going to take care of in a significant manner. Everything is going to seem okay. Type 777 assuming you as of now accept. You will be awestruck by a torrent of blessings, miracles, and breakthroughs over the next three days. Everything in your life, from your job and finances to your health and relationships, will undergo a supernatural transformation. Anticipate unforeseen endowments and an overflow of affection and wealth of everything great. November and December are your long periods of joy, and you can hope to get brilliant supernatural occurrences, surprising favors, and a twofold portion of euphoria and bliss. If you believe, type 222. Jesus declares, I have opened a door for you that no one can close, and the divine plan that has been set in motion for your life cannot be stopped by anyone. God is your refuge and strength in the world that can be hard, and he is always there for you when things get tough. Before this week reaches a conclusion, your life will be spilling over with such countless endowments that every one of your concerns will vanish. Angels have been entrusted to safeguard and direct you and your loved ones as the Lord sends you people, resources, and finances you never imagined possible. If you believe in angels, type 333. It is impossible to please God without faith but those who seek him will be rewarded. Right now, the Lord is changing your life, transforming your poverty into wealth and your sorrows into joy. You can rely on God in your difficulties in the same way that Daniel did in the lion's den. Anyone who comes to Jesus will never be hungry because he is the bread of life. He is the light in the darkness and he will give you rest if you are exhausted and burdened. Come to him for the joy and peace that only he can bring. If you have faith in Jesus, type 555. Dear God, we are grateful that November has arrived. I ask that you protect our family and friends and family this month. Protect us with your divine protection and watch over us. Give us strength, blessings, 
and good health. Get rid of any doubt, anxiety, worry, or fear in our hearts. At the point when troublesome times come, assist us with confiding in you with our entire being and not rest on our own comprehension. Lord, we are grateful that you heard our prayer and blessed us. Amen. My prayer, in Jesus name. I need to end with a request for you, ruler. We look for your direction and favors as we explore this way of affection and understanding. As we persistently anticipate the heavenly arrangement of hearts, we request strength, persistence, and the insight to perceive the unfurling of this wonderful story. May the discovery of love be gentle and profound, touching our souls to the core. And may the bonds that are formed endure and be strong. We ask for your divine protection and direction as we look forward to the end of the year, when expressions of love will be shared openly, believing that everything will work out as planned. Much thanks to you for your consistent presence and backing on this excursion towards adoration. Amen. To claim this message and the blessings contained within, type 444. In the following video, where you will hear it, there is an important message.